Hi, Barbie dolls. I'm Azusa Bobby, Bobby Lava in West Hollywood. Thanks for watching my video. Today I'm doing pink food cooking. Even in Southern California, now it's officially fall season. Is. So I wanted to cook something with seasonal ingredients. I'm originally from Japan. Do you know what I've been missing from Japanese food? So there is a Japanese dessert which is simply called sweet potato. I really miss Japanese sweet potato. Today I'm gonna mix that sweet potato dessert in pink color. So you know there are two purposes. One is trying to create new pink food recipe and number two is showing you guys one Japanese dessert. Sounds awesome, right? So American sweet potatoes has kind of darker color, almost like orange color. That Japanese sweet potatoes has a lighter yellow, but it's still yellow. You know, when you cook any pink food, always white or lighter color is easier. Then I just found the perfect ingredient of groceries today. White sweet potato. They're white. I mean, slightly beige, but I think the color is totally white enough to cook something pink. Let's start. I need to wash these sweet potatoes and I will peel the skin first. The inside is so white, but the taste is supposed to be sweet. Cut sweet potatoes into smaller pieces. Soak in water 10 minutes. It's been 10 minutes. Cooking wrap like this and put in microwave till they get softer. And microwave for 5 minutes. Yeah, you need to mush them. When it's cooked, actually, it doesn't look white anymore. Turn yellow, actually. So I don't know if I could really make this into cute pink. So here I mash all the sweet potatoes and I put melted butter and sugar. And I put egg yolk, vanilla flavor. Now it's the coloring part. So here I put whipped cream in beet butter. And I put this here. So I made a lot of pink heart and also the shape of sweet potatoes. Actually, this shape is standard shape when we make Japanese sweet potatoes. And now I put egg yolk on the top. I baked for 17 minutes. Ah, looks so cute! Oh my god, smells so good. So the one I put egg here, of course, they look a little bit yellowish, but they're shinier. Anyway, they both look so cute. Finally done. Ta-da! Look, they came out really cute. Pink heart. Let me try one. Se no, itadakimasu. Yummy. I'm melting. Mmm. I mean, it just tastes so good. I have three favorite food. Number one favorite food is crepe. I cannot decide which is the second and third, but second and third is Japanese pudding and Japanese sweet potato. I really like Japanese dessert. Anyway, the Japanese sweet potato, its flavor is milder than American sweet potato. I put butter and sugar, but not too much. The sweetness is really mild and gentle. Mm. And really creamy, soft. 
Mm. If you try this for the first time, you might think it's not cooked, but actually it's totally cooked. The texture is really creamy and soft. It's so good. You know what? I'm having a one more. I forgot to show you. So regular sweet potato is like this shape. So usually we shape like sweet potato shape in bake. Oh, but not pink. Usually the color is like a golden yellow brown. Looks good too. I put both beets butter in food coloring, but I'm pretty sure even only with beets butter, it could be still pink, but not like this very pink. If you don't prefer putting artificial food coloring mix with beets butter. I don't know, maybe some of you will think, Oh, I just saw you put food coloring all the time. It's not healthy for you. Thank you for caring my health, but I'm not eating pink food all the time. So don't worry, also eat regular food. When I'm not eating pink food, actually my diet is pretty healthy. So don't worry. Mmm, much delicious. Thanks for watching my video. I hope you like my video. Subscribe my channel and follow me on Instagram. Hope you have a fantastic Barbie day. Bye.